Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to Stranded Deep. For those of you that have been around with the channel for a very long time, you probably would remember this as being the first game that was actually on my channel. Uh, sadly, I took the videos down a long time ago because of the terrible, terrible mic audio I had at the time. Not that it's any better now, but it's not that bad. Uh, keep an eye on this guy. Uh, sadly, I already recorded this bit already, and uh, I had a bit of a misrecording. And so the first part didn't actually make it through. But anyways, welcome to Strand Deep. Coming up next, basic crafting and port inventory management. Don't go away, will you? Ha ha ha. Oh, sh you heard me. <coughs> Sorry about that. I thought I, I could have sworn my volume at that level had been turned down. Okay, I'm going to have to drop this. This... For one, I don't need it right now, and two, I don't have the space for it, and three, I have absolutely no idea what I need it for. Ooh, a rock. Yeah. Ooh, plastic bag. Ooh, plastic bag. Aloe vera. That's actually something I know will come in handy for, like, sunburns and stuff like that, so... Where's my raft? Okay, there. This looks like a good place to set up. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, put that away, pick that up. And then we can go ahead and make a, a refined knife. Put place that on the ground, and then we can use the refined knife to make... Oh, two stone tools for a crude axe. Okay, there's one stone tool, two stone tools, and there is a crude axe. Perfect. So now we can actually go cut down some trees. Uh, we'll leave that one for now. Actually, no. We'll take the big one down. We'll leave the, low, the lower ones down so the coconuts regrow. And yes, they will respawn after a few days. Uh, I think everything will except for the palm trees themselves. But I like the small little trees here. They should respawn. Yeah, you do have to watch out for that. Now, where did me coconuts go? Are they still on there? Oh, they fall off. I need those. There they are. Yes, we actually need those. Uh, we also need palm fronds too. So we're going to cut the palm bunch off the top. We're going to use that to make our first shelter. And we're also going to make a fire too. Try to get ourselves settled. Uh, Inventory is always, always a problem in this game. Uh, um, uh, um. Okay, why is that not stacking? There we go. That ain't working. Uh, there we go. That'll work. Okay, where was the raft? The raft is here. Let's, uh, this is just temporary for now. That's not what I wanted to do. I hit C. We're going to do shelter. I need one more lashing. What did I do with that lashing? Um, I gotta find that lashing now. Actually, how many fibers do I have? Four. I need two more. Two more. Come on, where are they? Uh, there's one. And yeah, the axe, the, the crude axe is definitely a hell of a lot better than a stone tool. Definitely. Uh, we will need these tools, like the knife for skinny meat, which I will show you soon. Okay, what's that? Oh, and I leveled up on my harvesting. And I think that means I can harvest faster. I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so we got that, and... What was I going to make now? <laughs> Shelter. Aha. Alright, so let's... Where was the uh, container? Container was on this side, I think. Nope. Other way. Other way. I'm getting lost. The silence so big, right? I gotta watch my stamina. At least the bar changes color so it's easier to see. Alright, and it is getting dark, so we're gonna have to get that going. Let's uh, gather up some wood here quickly. Uh, I know it's dark. I'll make this quick because it's gonna start getting cold too. Do have to watch out for hypothermia. Yeah, 
Yes, it's dark. I do have a flashlight, but I can't cut a tree while I'm using the flashlight. Okay. So we'll go in here, we craft a campfire. Okay, and we'll place that there. And I need two more sticks to make kindling. And it is dark. I can't see anything. Uh, no, we're not cut down you. We'll cut you down you, I guess. Uh, you can find an iron axe. I don't know if they're ever going to be adding, uh, like, making iron tools down the road. Uh, there is sort of an end game in the, ga in the game. And it, I think, I believe it's more or less fine enough, finding all the parts to make uh, the gyrocopter. At least that's as far as I know. Okay, now we can go ahead and actually light our fire. And this is how we do it. What's even more fun is how we cook. Gotta be the best cooking mechanic ever. Alright, we'll uh, leave the lighter there for now. Uh, where is my refined knife? Uh, let's go grab the flashlight. Alright, and... I, I did not actually grab the flashlight. She got to click. That's why. Uh... And as far as I know, unless they've changed it, it does not have a ba uh, battery that'll run out. Okay, it's a stone. And I remember, like, when this game, when I first started playing the game, I think it was something about, like, living to day, surviving to day 80. And then you had to actually start a fire somewhere, like, sort of like a smoke signal, in order for the a, a passing plane to actually see you. Uh, other than that, I don't know of any actual story in the game. Where did my refined knife go? Oh my god. That was an entire lashing I missed. I lost. Oh my god, where did I put it? Where did I put it? Where's the palm from? I guess I have to make another one. Um... Uh, Oh yes, the bats. Good source of leather. We'll have to start making some spears soon. And food. And I'll come and get you guys as soon as I find my knife. That's what I'm looking What I am looking for. Uh, we do have to watch, keep an eye on the fire too, because the fire will go out over time. Uh, you can place sticks or logs or palm fronds in there. You know, anything that burns. But yeah, I made that somewhere and I dropped it because I was making the axe. Gotta be around here somewhere. I might have to get a few more and make another one. By the looks of it, I got the soft music playing while I'm trying to find my knife that I made. I could have sworn it was like right over here somewhere. As I made the lashings next to Yuka. Wow, that grew back already. At least I think that's the same one. Anyway, uh, let me look around. Okay, I finally did it. I had to juggle my inventory a little bit, but I do have it. Uh, give me that. Okay. Now let's find us some food. Uh, probably have to fill that fire up again. That's fine. But at least I know I have a spare knife here somewhere. Okay, what do I have for wood? Nothing. Alright, uh, oh, there's a stick there, and that's it. That'll be good for now, let's just go ahead and, as you can see there is a bar to show you how full it is, so, that being said, now we go ahead and uh, take care of these two guys here. And that's the sad part is getting crabs and don't ask me why we get steaks from them we just do but it's food all right we have food and all we do is uh drop that and then we drop the food on the ground we pick it up and we place it right on top of the fire and hit a sizzle and that's how we cook in stranded deep until we make the smoker at least uh, we can also make a, a fire pit, which has the, the roasting skewer, but I think you can only do one piece at a time. 
Okay, so we have our shelter, we have our fire, we have some food cooking, and now we need water. So we'll drop that, go ahead and grab you all the axe. We crack them open. If I can hit right. Uh, as you can see, I am thirsty. So let's pick one up. Pick them both up, actually. And let's see how much it actually fills up. Not much. Okay, right, so we're going to drop that. And drop that. So it's close enough. But we can actually split them open and actually eat the coconuts. Uh, the problem is in this game, food does spoil and fly apparently. So, how long food actually lasts, I have no idea, but that's the whole challenge of it. Oh, that wasn't good. Never eating that again. Okay, well, I ate too much of that. Oh, that really dehydrated me. Ooh. Oh, God, diarrhea. Yeah. Always fun on a Let's Play, huh? Alright, uh, it's still cooking, so I'm going to have to lay off the coconuts for a while. I wonder if you can actually cook this stuff. No, you can't. I'm going to knock my meat off. Anyway. Oh, one of them's done. That one is done. Wow, I am really thirsty. I'm going to have to go find another coconut or two. So I'll bring you back in the morning. Okay, well, it seems I may not li survive through the night, so we're going to go ahead and make a few things here. What we're going to do is we're actually going to make a uh, water still. Uh, yes, over here. Uh, first, I need to make a uh, coconut flask. Now, I was trying to find this, but I forgot there's consumables up here. So, we actually need... Oh, we actually need a full coconut. Okay, uh, there's one over here somewhere. Somewhere in one of these trees. Let me uh, get a flashlight. Let me uh, drop my second kin. No, drop the kindling. Because I actually need that. So we'll get the flashlight out. Let's go see if we can find something cl close by we can reach. There we go. Okay, back to uh, consumables. Make a coconut flask. And then we go over here and we can make water still with. Two more rocks and a palm frond. Now, I got the palm frond. We got one rock. And. And. I said, and. And an island out in the middle of nowhere, and there's no rocks. Except palm, palm fronds growing out of the sand. No, I'm sure there's one around here. Almost looks like rats running across the ground. There's a rock. Okay, let's take you. And we'll run over here. And this means that I have to make another coconut flask. So I can actually make water. Oh. We're going to pick that thing up. Maybe not. Okay, V. Uh, if stuff is on the ground, you can craft. If it's really close to you, it actually has to be basically right underneath you now. Oh, why did you not craft? Oh, because I didn't click it. Okay, so. Uh, guess we'll just put it there for now. And it is empty. That's fine, so we can drink right out of there. Let's see if I have enough to make another flashing. Uh, another lashing. No. So let me gather up a lashing and I shall return. Okay, I got myself a flask, which is basically a makeshift bottle. And there is water in the still. Water still fiber. Hmm. But anyways, you can collect that in that bottle. Oh. Oh, there was water still in there. Okay. And then we can collect that and drink that. And that's going to give us better water. It's not going to give us the runs. And it's not going to dehydrate us. And I think this might be a good place to call it. Because uh, let me check the recording time here. Actually, we're not doing too bad. So what I'll do. Take a bit of a nap. I'll sleep. And sleeping and saving is the same thing. And that is the only way to save in the game. There's no auto saving. Day survived. One. And... 
I'm still alive. Good. Alright, uh, fire is almost out. Uh, I'll put it out for now. We'll save the wood because we don't need it. Uh, this is going to take some time to fill up. And I think... I wonder if we should brave another one of these ships. Probably not. Uh, but what I can do, though, is while I'm waiting for that to freshen uh, to fill up, I want to see if I can find any more of these fibers. Because I have to wait for this to actually grow back before I can actually harvest it again. Which kind of sucks, because, like I said, that's our only source of rope, and we actually need it for... Uh, no, we don't actually need it for that. Okay, that's pretty good. Uh, we will need it for things like doors and whatnot, but uh, at this early in the game, as long as we get some sort of shelter, that's all that really matters. So, let's clear out some trees while we're waiting for our water to build up. Oh, that's the wrong button. Okay, I'm just going to get rid of these small ones because they don't bear us any fruit anyway, so... I'll chop them down. I'll level up and harvesting again. Alright. Uh, I still have that tr trunk to cut down too. Got a few more here. Uh, I may end up making a pickaxe eventually, but uh, we need stone to make that pickaxe. Uh, right now the only thing that there is is the stone. Well, there's actually other stuff, but here all there is is stone. But we might find clay or some other stuff on a different island when we get to it. When we get to it. I also want to eventually make get a better raft going too. Because that dinghy they start us out with isn't the greatest. Okay. Where are we at here? I'm lost on the big island. Okay, that's a fiber. Yes, I know I need to find water. Hopefully. Nothing. It's empty. Of course it is. I might have to get another one of those. Well, let's actually see what it takes to make the cloth. Uh, be under. Should be under tools. Oh yeah, the loom. We're a little ways from the loom. We are dying. I really don't want to drink another coconut though. Ugh. Guess I don't have a choice. Let's drop that there for now. <sighs> I better not. I might want to wait till this thing fills up. But anyway, uh, let me cut a few trees down. There is a fruit plant here too. Uh, that is something we can do down the road is get into farming. So that'll come in handy. Actually, we actually have enough stu stuff to build something. So we might as well get something set up for now. We're waiting for the water to fill up here. Uh, it's not in there, it is here. Alright, so yeah, we can, you gotta use a hammer to actually basically fill stuff in. And as you can see from the menu here, oh, uh, all I can build is just the basic, basic stuff. There's wood and driftwood. So we're just gonna go with the wood. Uh, let's actually sort of get right over top here. Yeah, and we'll do another one. Uh, wood foundation, we'll just do like a 3x3 three by three by for now. And the way this building works is you actually have to hammer it in place. Just like so. And of course, the, uh, the more complete it is, the more protection it offers you. So, anyways, uh, let's do a quick check on the water here. Still nothing. Ugh. Gonna die here. Anyway, let me finish this up and I'll bring you back. A thought occurred. I was realizing why this wasn't actually collecting water. And I started thinking about the old, uh, the old water stills. Yeah, she had palm fronds underneath it. And the palm fronds actually generate the moisture. So I need to get these under there because I'm about ready to die. Uh, I can get away with drinking one coconut milk. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Let's drop that. Okay. Aha. Oh, that's cool. New mechanics. Gotta love them. 
All right. Well, hopefully, uh, it's gonna get me alive pretty quick. I don't know if you can hear it. Can you hear it dripping? That scared me. But I'm still alive. Hey, I found my other knife. I don't know what it was doing over here, but there it is. Uh, I am not gonna survive very long. What we're gonna do, though? Gonna do that. Oh, the campfire went out. Oh, get rid of that, and let's get this fire going again. Cause I gotta get some food. Uh, where is my kindling? There's my lighter. There it is. Yeah. And hopefully by the time this is done, I'll have water, and I can drink and not die on the th second day, third day technically. And presto. Okay. Still no water. That is fine. Let's go get us some crabbies. Get some crabby patties. Uh, may dismantle that. See what we can build out of it. I don't think we're going to be able to build anything out of it anytime soon until my building goes up. Okay. We got any... Got any crabbers around. Unfortunately, can't cook... Cra uh, can't cook... Um, Coconut meat, but oh, that's not what I was looking for. There are sardines. Let's see if we can actually grab these little guys. No, I think we actually have to spear those guys. Where are the crabs? These little buggers used to be everywhere. Aha! Come here, lunch. Helps if I hold the right button. There, just get him underwater so at least it's all clean. Uh, shut up, it's food. Unless you want to eat seagull. I'd rather eat crab. Ooh, crab ahoy. Alright, uh, skin you. Fortunately, you're not live. But you are. Not MR. Alright. Trifecta. So let's go ahead and get these on the fire. There's one. Oh, that one fell off. It's okay. It's just sand. Okay, there's one. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. It can be a little finicky at times. Especially when it doesn't want to go on top of the fire. Yeah, it's, uh, the cooking could use a little bit of work, but I think that's what the hobo stove is supposed to really help out with. Never actually used it. Might try it. Oh, I heard water. I heard water. Okay. Oh, come on. I can't even see what that notification said. Perfect. <gasps> Oh, water and food. Perfect. Okay, well that is going on. This is what I got so far. Now uh, let's go ahead and put maybe put some stairs in if I can. I don't know how expensive those are gonna be. Uh, stairs. Yeah, lashing. Okay, we're not gonna worry about stairs then. Uh. I'll do a wood arch. And why do you not want to go on? Okay, what's going on here? There we go. Alright, now let's get some walls up. Uh uh, I don't know how I want to do this. Let's start with the windows. Okay, let's get up here if we can. Oh uh, yeah, we're gonna have to do it this way. So, do I want the windows there? Yeah, that's how, how I'm gonna do it. I'm going to place windows on either. 
Do I really have to build it this way? Let's see if I can do it the other way here in, from inside. No, not quick craft. Okay. Okay, I can't do it this way. Just basically got to hover it. And I am going to put another doorway on this end because that's where we're going to be docking our boat. A raft or whatever we may make. And of course, I am out of sticks. So, let's uh, check our vitals. How's the food doing? Okay, we do have to watch out because you can't actually overcook it too. And there we go. We are surviving. Oh my gosh, I think I've done this before. How's the fiber doing? Okay, that's a whole reason. That's a good reason to cut down palm trees. Uh, I was working on a few. As you can see, we're almost out of the big trees here. We're always stripped this island clean. Uh, I really don't want to take the small ones down because they're an easy source of coconut, but uh, at this point, I think coconut's about the last of my worries. But I think we're going to be probably finishing this one up soon. We might actually look into getting a, a better raft going, and maybe we'll do some exploring. Uh, just check out the island. We'll take the compass with us, too, and see what we can actually find. So let me cut down a couple more trees. I do want to leave a few on here so we can at least see where we're going. And I will return. Okay, so I've been out in the sun for a little while. And as you can see, I am sunburnt. Sunstroke, yes. So, uh, yes, the SPF is how long I have till I actually burn. That is nice. That is actually why I'm trying to do what I'm doing here. Uh, any mini mining model will take you. We have to get this done. Fortunately, I have the aloe vera here, so I can start making sunscreen if I really need to. But I actually want to try to get, get a quick roof on there if I can. I do have the walls basically built. It's just a matter of throwing a roof on top, and at least we have a, a shady place to hide. Uh, I gotta make sure not to lose these palm leaves either, because uh, these are our water source. It's actually, I'm actually glad they gave us a better use of those things. Okay, let's go in here and see if I can actually throw a roof on here. Uh, isn't too much for a roof, but maybe I could put a floor. And, okay, and in this way at least we have a place to hide when it gets too hot. That did not work. I probably should get these walls in too while I can. While I have the supplies. One there. And. Yeah, as I said. While I had the supplies. Fortunately, everything gets used. Is already accounted for once you build the frame. So when you hammer it in, it's. It's really more or less durability factor. So at least I'm in the shade now. So as you can see, the SPF is going back up again. All right, how are we doing for water? Very good. We gotta fill this thing back up. That's gonna get us more water, actually. Uh, yeah, we'll leave that there. Put the fire out for now. And what else? Could use some more sticks. There's a couple of sticks right here. So easy to cut down to. Problem is those are don't have as many as I'd like to have. And sure. At least it'd be easy to remember which island is mine, the one without trees on it. So yeah, I'm gonna do a little more chopping and I will return. <laughs> Okay, I am pretty much done. I just need to cut down one more tree so I can fill up what you would call a roof. It's nothing more than just a floor because I'm too cheap. I'm not going to remember to collect these things because I'm going through a lot of water. And we have taters here, I believe, somewhere. That's a rock. That's a palm prawn. I thought that was potatoes, but apparently not. Okay. So we are somewhat shacked up. All I got left to do is do one more floor. 
like so. Finish it up. At least we have a place to hide in the shade. And I have more water to drink. Okay, so we can go ahead and put more of those in there. And I am going to just drop whatever I have right here. And that's where those things are going to come in handy because we can actually use those for storage so we can place stuff in there. And I just remembered we have a little ration box here. We do have actual rations. So I want to actually take those. And I don't think we have to actually cook these, but uh, sadly, I think this is how we have to actually open them. At least I thought it was. Well, let me crouch down. Did we use a knife? Oh. Apparently we can and all. Interesting. Okay, well. Sure, whatever works. And by the way, you can actually see the flies flying around the spoiled coconut. That's cool. But we can do we can do this and throw it away. Or actually, we can throw it further away so we don't actually pick it up. Just like so. But with that, I think it's a good place to call it. We have finally survived. We got ourselves a little little home away from home on our stranded island in the middle of absolute nowhere. I think next episode we might have to do a little bit of adventure and try to find something, anything at this point, uh, whatever we can to survive. And with that, I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a like, and I will see you in the next one. Later.